Well, it's Monday and it's been a few days since I've been in the shop. We went away for the weekend, so uh, no woodworking for a few days and uh, I've decided to flatten the second uh, top. So uh, I just started with the uh, spoke shave <coughs> here and because it's so narrow and you run into the to the uh, sides rather quickly uh, I've taken one of the handles off you can do the middle with the, the handles on but then with one of them off you have to uh, grab it a little different uh, but it does uh, and then scrape it so uh, we'll check in with uh, me later so I use the uh, spoke shave to smooth it out and uh, then I used a cabinet scraper to uh, smooth the grooves out I don't know how well you can see it but it's pretty smooth there's a few one piece of tear out there deal with later but um, the center part is pretty smooth right now of the table so now I got to get to the uh, to the circles I finally found a use for this little plane that I have here and uh, I sharpened the blade And it works pretty good. It's moving areas that I can't get at with a spoke shave. And then I can scrape it. It's taking off a little bit of a too much of a shaving at the moment, but we'll uh, I'll lighten it up in a second. Well, I've been at it a little while here, and uh, I've got a few of them smoothed out. One, two, three, four, and a half. This one here is just coming along. So I tackled the, the more difficult ones first today. This one, that one, those aren't too bad. They won't take too long, I don't think. Um, the downside, when I cut the quarter inch uh, circles around, it looks like I must have tipped the router as I came off the uh, template. And uh, so I have this little bit deeper groove all all the way around so getting that out and getting it smooth and is a bunch of work but it's coming so uh, I'm using it as a learning experience and uh, need some patience and uh, I'm sure it'll come out just fine so then I'll have two tops and I can select from the better of the two. Um, this one has quite a bit of character in it. Uh, you've got this knot right here and then this 
craziness. More like a burl um, in the wood down here. A streak that runs across there. So uh, when it's uh, smoothed out, back up here. Um, we'll see uh, which one we end up with. Uh, this one has some discoloration in the middle, but uh, again, they're all both both are going to be stained, so we'll see how it comes out.